don't know about everyone, but I've been watching a lot of baking shows during quarantine. Watching all of these sweets being made caused me to crave them. But it's difficult going out to buy sweets right now with the risk of catching COVID. So here's an easy donut recipe you can do at home for those cravings. First, you're going to want to heat one cup of milk in the microwave until it's warm, not hot. I'd say about 25 to 30 seconds. Then you're going to add that warm milk into your mixing bowl along with one third cup of granulated sugar and one tablespoon of activating yeast. Mix everything until it's well combined. Scrape the bowl if necessary. After you're done mixing, cover your bowl and let the yeast rest for five minutes. While the yeast is resting, take six tablespoons of butter and melt it in the microwave until it's liquid. I'd say around 30 seconds. After it comes out, make sure it's not hot by letting it rest until you add it to the yeast mixture later. Uncover your bowl of yeast mixture. Add two cups of flour and two eggs. The melted, warm, not hot butter. One teaspoon of vanilla. Mix until combined, two minutes. The reason why you have to make sure everything is warm and not hot is because yeast will die at 120 degrees Fahrenheit. After two minutes of mixing, add two more cups of flour gradually. Mix until the dough falls off easily from the bowl. Transfer the dough onto a lightly floured surface and net for two minutes. After you finish netting, put the dough in an oil grease bowl. Cover the bowl with a wet towel and then leave the bowl in a warm place to rest for one and a half hours. After one and a half hours, roll out the dough into a half inch thick disc. Take your donut cutter, if you have one, and cut out donut shapes. If you don't have a cookie or donut cutter, skip this step and just form the donuts into small balls instead to make donut holes. Heat the oil until it's hot. Flip the donut on each side until it's golden brown. For me, it was around 10 seconds on each side. Finish frying. This recipe makes a lot, a little more than a dozen. I burned too really badly, but we are going to pretend we did not see that. You can search up what kind of glazes you want to make on the internet. For me, I went with chocolate. 